Good morning, guys. We have taken a break uh, for uh, quite some time now from the videos on the installation of the Nismo body kit on the 370. Uh, on today's video, we are fitting the bumper on the 370 for the first time. How is it gonna go? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> we're, we're gonna have to find out. Um, thank you for everybody that's been watching and following the build. Um, and any other video that I've been putting out um, subscribe uh, to the channel guys please there is a, a lot more content coming up um, I'm planning on finishing this 370 very soon there is a meet coming up that I'm really want to go and I want uh, this bumper to be on the car already and I have the I want uh, the kit to be already finished and on the vehicle so I can go ahead and show it off um, at the meet uh, so stay tuned, um, subscribe, like I said again, to the channel. Uh, a lot more fun videos coming up. And I hope you enjoy this video. Um, it's not going to be easy, but it's not meant to be. It's not meant to be easy. It's meant to be hard. Um, like I always say, what's, what's the fun in easy? So I hope you enjoy the video. Thank you. Inside, bro.
uh, so it fits pretty good around the lights. That's what she said. I think I'm gonna have to put this on the car without the mountain bracket, without the, without this bracket. You see this right here? I, there's a bolt that goes there. So I think that bolt that bolt goes through here. So that bolt holds this to the fender. Yeah. I think I'm gonna have to take this off and mount this with with the bolts here. If you don't push this from behind, you break it. And if you break it, you buy it. <laughs> like, esto aquí atrás? Tu sabes como hacerlo? Yeah, because I did the last, the back ones. There you go. Wow. Pero you got, if you don't know that, this will be broken right now. Ah, me mismo mayo, ahí me. Ahí me. Back it up. Working in the dark here. Dude, that looks like a really shit fit. Is that going in the hole? It is going in the hole, bro. It's supposed to be like that? Sticking out? No. It's supposed to be like that, sticking out. <laughs> yeah. That's how it is, dude. You're kidding. That looks like shit. That's uh, perfect. <laughs> Look, I can <laughs> Am I still supposed to be recording this? What? Am I still supposed to be recording this? Yeah. Alright, bro, it has to fit like this. Alright. Can you just buy the actual bumper? Well, where would be the phone at? <laughs> <laughs> That would be fine. It's actually not that bad. It needs a little work, but it's not that bad. <laughs> we got we got a lot of problems. <laughs> I'm gonna stop recording. I know you. I know you are. All right, guys. So um, that's gonna be all for today. Uh, we learned a couple of things today by fitting this bumper on the 370Z. Once it fits nicely on the car around the headlamps, the fitment is not that bad. Uh, but there are a couple of downsides. Um, the mounting points are really bad, and uh, the only way to really put the bumper on the vehicle is uh, to remove the plastic retainers that hold the OEM bumper onto the vehicle, on the fenders. As you saw in the video, um, the new uh, aftermarket Nismo bumper cover is going to have to be fastened um, with bolts to the fender on the vehicle. Um, also, the reason why right now it doesn't fit like it should is because there is some plastic brackets that go underneath the headlamp that are preventing the bumper from going in all the way. 
So therefore, it's sticking out on one of the corners more than the other. Um, so this is going to be all for the video today. Um, we're going to pick it up on the next video and widen the holes on the mounting points, fasten um, the bumper onto the car re and remove the plastic brackets under the headlamps so we can get a proper fitment. And once we do that, then we can go ahead and paint this bumper and it'll be done. Uh, at the same time that we paint the new bumper, we're going to paint the side skirts. Uh, I have already pre-fitted those on the, on the vehicle. They do fit perfectly. Uh, no issues with those. There is no uh, modifications needed um, with the side skirts. But the bumper is a whole different story. There is a lot more components in the front of the vehicle. Um, I'm confident that I can make it happen. It's looking like it's, it's going to give me a little bit of issues, but it's doable. Anything is doable. If you really put your mind to it, anything can be done. Um, so guys, subscribe to the channel um, and keep watching. Um, I'll keep uh, putting out videos. Uh, I'll try to do it every weekend. Uh, every Saturday and Sunday, I'll try to put a new video. That's when I work on the vehicle because I work during the week at my regular job. Uh, if, you guys, if you guys have any questions uh, regarding the installation uh, of these parts on the car, anything that you want me to cover, please comment below um, and let me know. Uh, feel free to ask me any questions. Um, I'll be more than happy to answer um, any questions. Thank you.